In this video, I'm going to show you two ways to draw an arrow in AutoCAD. The first is by using the leader command. So type in leader, specify your start point, just turn auto off, and then click the end of where you want your line to be. Uh, using the leader command also gives you an option to enter in text at the end. Um, I'm going to type in something. So you can see I've drawn a line with an arrow on the end of it and with text at the end. Also, because this is the leader and the text, the leader is associated with this text object, whenever I move the text, the leader will follow. So the second way to draw an arrow in AutoCAD is first you need to open up the tool palette. So we can just start typing tool palettes, hit enter. Then under the annotation tab, you can scroll down to arrows. You can have arrows imperial or arrows metric. I'm just going to select metric. I'm just going to accept that for the moment. And then you can click where you want it to be. Um, there's a whole bunch of dynamic features with this. You can use this to set the length of the arrow. This will set the rotation of the arrow. And this will set the arrow type so it can be double arrow, single arrow. I'm not sure what a fancy arrow is. And then you can change the direction of the arrow just by clicking the end of that that node there. So that is two ways that you can draw an arrow in AutoCAD.